Look at this score, 83. So I'm in Neuron Writer right now. This is going to be a quick Neuron Writer tutorial. I'm going to show you a feature that is often overlooked by people. And I think it makes a big difference in your SEO optimization scores that you can achieve with the tool. In this case, I came in at an 83. Top competitor is a 73. It was very easy to do with the tools that Neuron Writer has available to you. Here's what I want to say quickly about Neuron Writer. If you have never purchased the tool at all, it's available in AppSumo.com. It's a lifetime deal. It starts at $89. Now, $89 gets you a single code. I recommend buying in on at least three codes. I strongly recommend that you either upgrade from your single or double code to multiple codes or buy in at multiple codes. This gives you access to every feature that's available in Neuron Writer right now. Do that before this lifetime deal goes away. I do not know how much longer it's going to be around. I'm surprised it's been on for as long as it has. It's the AppSumo tool of the year for 2023. And really, it's the best deal that they have going right now on AppSumo. I am an affiliate. I will receive a commission if you purchase through my link in the video description. Let's go ahead and get right into this tutorial. Everything starts off with a keyword in Neuron Writer. You need a keyword to do your SEO optimization. In this case, I'm going to go ahead and go with this keyword here. I'm in Lowfruits right now. It's my favorite keyword tool for finding long tail keywords. This is great. Look at all this green. This means this is something that I want to write an article for. I'm going to go ahead and copy this keyword because everything in Neuron Writer is focused on a content query where you're going to put in your long tail keyword. I'm going to do a new query. I'm going to copy my keyword in how dangerous is mountain biking and let's start the query. The query is done. I'm going to click on how dangerous is mountain biking. It's going to come back with the search engine ranking pages for this particular article. These are the ones that are checked off by default by Neuron Writer. I'm going to go ahead and just go with those. This is the competition that you have to compete against when you write the article. Just make sure that the articles that are being checked off match search intent. You want to as closely match the search intent of your keywords as possible. We've done that. And we're going to click Update Competitor Selection and Continue. The next thing that we're going to want to do in this workflow before we do anything else is we need a title. We're going to click in the Title field. We're going to have it automatically generate a title for us. And today I'm just going to go with exactly what it gives me. You may tweak the title if you want to. For example, you could make some adjustments, maybe pull in a few more of these phrases, which would help with your SEO optimization score. But for now, let's just go with what we get from Neuron Writer. We'll put a description in. So there's our meta description. We save and close. This is very key here. The next thing that we want to do is go in to this outline tab. It's over here on the right hand side. You'll see terms outline, AI writing, and media. We want to go to outline. And what we want to do is pick AI outline. And we're going to do generate outline. But notice that it automatically pulls our title in. That's why I wanted it to create that title before we went over and use the AI outline tool. Now, before you just run off and click right for me, let's change the generation settings. Now, I typically leave the creativity at high. But I like to use GPT-4 instead of 3.5. And, you know, it says it discourages GPT-4 in advanced templates like one-click article. We're not doing that, so we're not going to worry about that. We're just going to click right for me. So Neuron Writer has generated this AI outline for us. This is a critical piece of what we're doing. So I'm going to pause the video and prepare this outline for the next step in the process. One thing I want to quickly point out before I go on to the next step is I included at the very end of the article a conclusion. It did not include that. I included this. I always have conclusions on my articles. The next step in the process is for me to create this article using my 
uh, AI writing tool. And in this case, it's seowriting.ai. I happen to use three different tools. I use SEO Writing Koala Writer, and on occasion, I'll use Agility Writer as well for very technical documents. In this case, this is a little bit more of a generic document, so seowriting.ai is going to work perfectly for that. And the reason that I had to pause the video is I had to prepare the outline that was created by Neuron Writer so I could port it over into SEOwriting.ai. This is what I mean. In the case of SEOwriting.ai, you can use this enable the outline editor function. You click that, you go to this first section here, and then you copy your outline and drop it in. So this is the outline that was created by Neuron Writer. And so when SEOwriting.ai creates the article, this is the outline that it's going to use. So that's perfect. There's a few more things that we need to do. Uh, one thing that, of course, you're always going to need to do is you want to go to the section for the SEO piece right here and add your keywords. So I'm going to grab those and then we'll go ahead and drop those in and continue writing the article. Go back over. If you're unfamiliar with Neuron Writer, notice there's basic terms, there's extended terms. These are all terms that you'd like to have part of your article to be able to optimize at the highest level possible. What I do is I copy the list of terms. So now we have our basic text terms and our extended text terms. Just simply select, copy, go back over to your writing tool, in this case SEO writing, drop those keywords in, and then we'll do the rest of the article. We need a title, we'll grab the title, drop that in. And our long tail keyword is how dangerous is mountain biking, so I gotta grab that. Go back over to SEO writing, drop this in. Now there are just a few more settings after that. I always choose to use a friendly tone of voice. I'm just gonna use a third person, point of view, my target country in this case will be United States. I'm not going to use any images. I'm not going to use any YouTube videos for this, just so it generates faster. Here are all the keywords we're going to use. We want a conclusion, tables. We want H3s, lists, italics. I'm just going to say no to quotes. I want key takeaways. I do not want an FAQ. When you're doing this workflow, if your AI writing tool asks you if you want an FAQ, just say no. I'm going to connect to the network for real-time search results. So we're all good. Everything's in here. We're ready to publish so we can get the most optimized article possible from seowriting.ai. But again, this will work if you use Agility Writer, if you use any other AI writing tool that allows you to put in your own outline. That's the critical thing. You just need to be using an AI writing tool that will allow you to do that. And that's why I like seowriting.ai. They make it very easy for that to occur. So let's write this article. I'm going to go ahead and click Run. We'll come back when the article's written and finish out the optimization. Okay, the article's complete. Here it is. Debunking the Myth of Mountain Biking Danger, Your Comprehensive Guide. Here's the article. Just scroll through here. There's our conclusion. Now we need to get this over into Neuron Writer. We just simply copy it. Go back to Neuron Writer. So I just deleted the outline that we used in the article, and now I'm copying the full article in. And here's our score. We're at a 64. The top competitor is a 73. The top 10 have an average score of 48. So we're already outscoring those other top 10 articles, except for the very first one. So let's see if we can boost this score. There are ways to do this. I want to show you the easiest way to do it. Uh, I have done videos in the past where I featured this particular item that's a Neuron Writer, but in case you missed that, let me show you how that works. So we're going to go into the AI Writing tab, click on it. Now notice we've got AI templates here. Anything with this little lightning bolt and an A next to it is an advanced template. This is why I'm urging you to buy additional codes so you have at least three codes with Neuron Writer. Because if you don't, you can't use the feature that I'm about to show you. And what we're going to do is we're going to use an FAQ with unused terms. I like to go to the end of my article. Right after the conclusion, put in a paragraph mark. I click on FAQ with unused terms. I go down. 
neutral tone of voice. I used casual tone of voice, so I'm going to use informal to try to match up with the tone of voice. Then I go into generation settings. So you could just say right for me, but let's do generation settings. We're going to use high creativity. We're going to make sure it's writing in GPT-4, which it is. Now we'll go ahead and click right for me. So the FAQ is complete. You can see it here. The one thing that Neuron Writer does that I don't like is it makes these questions H2s. You want to make sure and add an FAQ header so people know where they're at in the article. Make it an H2 and then go through and make these H3s. I went ahead. I've made everything in H3 like it should be. Let's go back up. Let's look at our score. The top score for the highest selected competitor is a 73. Now we're at a 75. Simply by using the outline feature and going in and using the FAQ with unused terms, we used AI outline. We took that outline. We put it into our AI writing tool. We wrote our article. Then we came back over into Neuron Writer. We found our initial score. We wanted to make it better. So then we used FAQ with unused terms, and that boosted our score even further. Right off the bat, we're at a 75 after using those two features of Neuron Writer, and we are better than the top competitor. Now, where you rank will depend on many things. It depends on the age of your domain, how often you've been posting to your blog. There's just a lot of factors. Your backlinking structure, I talk about all these things in my videos because I want to make sure that you don't think that Neuron Writer is a magic bullet. What it's going to do is help you get to a level where you can at least outrank people for this keyword that have similar domain ratings to you and similar backlinking profiles. So that's a head start against your other competition particularly if you're a new blog, right? You need everything on your side to rank. And if you find a very underutilized keyword or a very long tail keyword or a zero volume keyword, you do have a chance even as a low domain rating blog to possibly rank. So Neuron Writer just helps boost you to that next step and you don't have to really spend as much time dealing with issues around SEO optimization. So again, I strongly urge you, if you are currently at a one code level or a two code level, get in, buy some additional codes, get to that three code level so you have access to all of the features that are in Neuron Writer so you can build the most optimized blog post possible. Use the outlining capabilities of your AI writing tools like I do with Koala Writer and SEO Writing and Agility Writer. If you thought this was a useful video, if it helped you out, please give it a thumbs up please subscribe, head over to AppSumo, grab those codes. I appreciate the support of the channel. And until next time, take care.